All right. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to another gameplay video for the Commodore 64. Today, I'll be trying out Centipede. Um, going to be using the Atari joystick plugged into the real hardware. Um, fortunately, I don't have a complete copy. I just got the cartridge only. Uh, I'm going to try to seek out a complete copy online at a reasonable price. Kind of get an idea and see the differences between this one and the other versions. Of course, I've only played this version. I haven't played the Atari 800 version yet, or the Atari computer version, and of course the console versions, except for I think the 7800. We'll go ahead and try this game out real quick, see if I can get a decent score on that. Let's hit F1, and F1 for one player. So, let's go ahead and jump into that. Alright, the fire button. One thing I noticed, the centipedes aren't exactly smooth scrolling. I've seen smoother. There we go. But still, looks like a fun game. Still looks like it's pretty consistent with centipede. Seems like the, uh, the sound of the spider is a little bit slower, too. Control's pretty good. Can't say it's uh, bad. I did. I did grow up playing the uh, joystick version of this, and so I'm not really that used to the trackball. I'm sure people that grew up playing this in the arcades. used to the, uh, ah. Wow. Seems like a lot more centipedes. When you, if you don't get one, it looks like they multiply quicker than I remember. Oh, wow. They're everywhere. Ah. You really got to get the last of the centipedes pretty quick. They multiply. There we go. Hmm. Hmm. All right, I gotta get these guys. See, they come out really quick if you notice that. I was down to two, and then they just popped out a bunch of them. All right. Ah, man. Rough. Right. There we go. Always like seeing the next screen change color. I want to get these centipedes. Take them out as soon as I can before they multiply. Alright. Oh! Ah, goodness. See if I can at least break 20,000 on this. Good, I got an extra life, I think, from that. Ah, there we go. Ah, all right, here we go. Let's see what I can do here. Mmm. Let's multiply so quick. Alright, 23,025 is my score on that. 
guess I'll see if I can try to beat that really quick. This is a short video. So far, it's only about five minutes long. Let's go ahead and just at least try one more time. Alright, try this again. Got a big chunk of them right there. Oh boy. Oh, now how's that going to work? Look at that. How am I going to get over there? Huh. I have an idea. Oh, there they go. I guess that spider ate the mushroom, but... Huh! So they could get out. Well, I'm just going to sit here and shoot some spiders. Hmm. Does anybody know if this happens in the arcade or any other version of it? Do they get stuck like that? I'm just curious. That's, uh, interesting. Let's see if I can beat my high score. I just beat my high score. Just noticed that. Mm. Mm. All right. Can I break at least thirty thousand? Yes. Alright, 32,000 in 60 F broke my high score. So that's pretty cool. Not the best run, obviously. I'm not that versed in Centipede. I'm not that great at it, but I'm sure some of you people out there that uh, play this like crazy or like awesome at it can get awesome scores. 
Um, but there, that's a look at uh, Centipede for the Commodore 64. Pretty cool game. I like it. Uh, pretty good translation. Um, very different from, from the other home versions, obviously. But uh, check it out if you can find it. Uh, play it and, you know, see what your high score is. Post your high scores in the comments or stuff like that. So take care, everybody. I will see you again next time with another gameplay video. Uh, fun, fun checking out these different versions of these games. It's so cool to see how they were programmed for different hardware and stuff like that. So take care, everybody, and I will see you again next time. All right.